Three-year-old Micah and her little sister got a treehouse this year. I like it. I love my treehouse. <laughs> this twenty-eight thousand dollar treehouse is a gift from their parents. Roughly three meters above ground, the platform was built into two large trees. The fancy hideout has a climbing wall, a bucket pulley, and a spiral slide. Well, one of the things I really wanted was a little door within the big door. So if you go up, there's a door handle for them that's their height, and then there's an adult-sized door as well. So I wanted them to not need us to go in, and so to make it feel more like a secret hideout. Bala Sander and his wife Lakshmi came to America 20 years ago. Unlike the Keenans, who built a treehouse for their daughters, the Sanders built one for themselves. So we wanted to build something, a secluded place where we can come and relax. We wanted to chill out, have、uh, a glass of wine. So it was more of what I wanted as a space, more than for the kids. <laughs> With beds, tables, and windows, it's a welcoming, comfortable place to spend a summer night. Both of these amazing treehouses were created by Dan Wright. He's the founder of Tree Top Builders and has built more than 400 tree houses since he started the company in 2003. I think overhyped up sense of freedom and independence, and that's I think why Americans particularly resonate with tree houses, because、uh, it, it gets you up off the ground. And for kids, their parents can't reach them anymore. They're up looking down, getting a new perspective on life. Wright's company hosts workshops on building your own tree house. 60-year-old Bob Miracle, who arrives in his own helicopter, wants to build one for his grandchildren. Certainly, the tree houses to my grandchildren is going to be just like this helicopter to me. They're going to be very excited. They'll always look forward to getting in it and just having a blast with them. Sandy Kiefer is a cello instructor. Her dream is to build three tree houses and use them for a bed and breakfast. I'm 63, almost 64. And people say, "Are you crazy to start on a dream now?" And I'm saying, "Are you crazy not to start on a dream now?" Installing the special tree boat, which requires both strength and accuracy, is the most important part of the work. As the tree grows, sometimes you need to move parts of the structure or cut parts of it away to give the tree room to grow. Each year, it gets thicker. The base is then lifted on top of the tree boats. It will soon become the foundation of a great treehouse, so kids or adults can enjoy playing in the treetops. For Enming Liu, I'm Lin Yang, VOA News, Westchester, Pennsylvania.